Hello everyone, welcome to my very first video on my YouTube channel, which is called Jared on Vinyl, pretty sure. Um, yeah, I've been wanting to start doing YouTube videos for a while, but I just never really found the time and I never really had the, uh, you know, like the motivation to do it until now. And if you follow this channel or subscribe, um, I don't want to get like, you know, my goal isn't to get famous or anything, but I just, I want to uh, really share some of my views on music and just show some of the the musical things that I have. And uh, this video is going to be showing my entire record collection. So I think, I, I know I have over 100 here, so I'm going to try and make it pretty quick, but I'm not really sure how many I have, but um you know i i enjoy watching videos like this so i i thought i'd make one and i hope you guys enjoy it so these are i'm pretty sure in alphabetical order so i'm going to try and keep it that way for this video so let's get into it the first one is abbott and costello who's on first on the radio which is a, a comedy duo they're really funny um Bachman Turner Overdrive, Not Fragile. The band, self-titled. The Beach Boys, 1961 through 1963. The Beach Boys, Icon. This is still sealed, I haven't opened it, but it's like a, a beach ball picture disc. Beach ball color. The Beach Boys Pet Sounds. The Beatles Abbey Road. The Beatles in Italy. This is a live. I'm not sure. I think it's live. I don't. Actually, on second thought, I don't think it's a live um, album. It's just a compilation album. It says in Italy for some reason. Uh, Beatles Let It Be. The Beatles Rock and Roll Music Volume 2 Compilation. The Beatles Revolver. This is a reissue. The Beatles Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band. The Beatles Something New. Uh, Beatles 6. This is Angela's, used to be Angela's, not anymore. The Beatles, 1967 through 1970, or some people call it the Blue Album. It's a compilation. Saturday Night Fever, various artists, but this is mainly a Bee Gees album. Hymns by the Blackwood Brothers gospel group uh, David Bowie Black Star this is kind of beat up um, I found it and it's kind of ripped right here as you can see um, there's kind of a glare because the whole thing is like black but um, yeah I need to I need to get a new copy of that Michael Buble love or heart it's just a heart emoji Glenn Campbell, By the Time I Get to Phoenix. The Cars, self-titled. Johnny Cash, Hymns from the Heart. Chicago 3. This is Chicago Live at Carnegie, Live at Carnegie Hall, Volumes 3 and 4. When I bought this, I didn't know, but this is a part of a box set, which has more albums, um, and it's a live concert, but uh, it's still good. Just hearing the middle to end of the concert, I think it is. Um, Phil Collins, face value. Phil Collins, hello, I must be going. Jason Crabb, Unexpected. 
He's a gospel artist. Uh, Crosby, Stills, Nash & Young, Deja Vu. Love this album. John Denver, Back Home Again. You know, it's my John Denver poster up there. I'm a big fan. I only have one of his albums, but I'm a big fan of his. Uh, the Lion King uh, soundtrack from the new one. I, this is still sealed, so that uh, gives you an idea of what I think of the music on here. Although I really love the new Elton John song, Never Too Late, that is on here. I really like that song, but uh, yeah, I'm probably never going to open this. Just keep it sealed. I like the original much better, soundtrack-wise. Um, Mary Poppins soundtrack. I love the music to this movie. I love it. Uh, Pinocchio. This is my small Disney section. I did have Cinderella, but I, I don't know what happened to it. Uh, Dixie Echoes. I feel like traveling on. This is another gospel group, gospel quartet. Uh, the Doobie Brothers, The Captain, and Me. The Doors, self-titled. Now to my Dylan section. Uh, Bob Dylan, Blood on the Tracks. Bob Dylan, Desire. Uh, Bob Dylan, The Free Wheelin', Bob Dylan. Love this cover, one of my favorite albums. Bob Dylan, Highway 61 Revisited. Bob Dylan, Infidels. Uh, John Wesley Harding, Bob Dylan again. Bob Dylan, Planet Waves. Bob Dylan and the band, actually. Um, yeah, really good. Bob Dylan, the real Royal Albert Hall concert, 1966. This is one of my favorite live albums ever. It's phenomenal. From where he first started to go electric. Um, Bob Dylan, interpreted by the Sound Symposium. I don't know where I got this. I don't know why I have this, but I just do. I've never listened to it. Eagles, The Long Run. The Electric Light Orchestra, El Dorado. My favorite album of theirs. Uh, Elvis, Aloha from Hawaii via satellite. His Hand in Mine, Elvis Presley. I love his gospel stuff. Uh, Elvis Presley, his songs of inspiration. Elvis, Merry Christmas, Baby. I got this from Cracker Barrel, I think. I don't know if I've ever played that. Peter Gabriel, uh, Peter Gabriel 1, which also known as Car. Peter Gabriel 2, also known as Scratch. Peter Gabriel 3, also known as Melt. Peter Gabriel, So. Uh, Genesis, Abacab. Yeah, Abacab. Gotta keep these things from falling over. I'm trying to stack them up nice and neat. Genesis, self-titled. And of course, is Phil Collins era Genesis. Genesis selling England by the pound. My favorite album of theirs. Vince Gill, The Christmas Collection. This is uh, one, two vinyls. One is red, one is green. So that's cool. Greater Vision. Um, a Greater Vision Christmas. It's on red vinyl. Um, yeah, I, another gospel group, one of my favorites. I love these guys. They're really good. Um, let me try and figure out where I'm going to put the rest of these. Figure it out later.
What is this? Benny Goodman, Swing in the Spring. This is a jazz album. It's pretty good. Ooh. Just drop this one. Ernie Haas and Signature Sound, A Jazzy Little Christmas. Signed by Ernie Haas himself. He's a gospel singer. Here's another gospel singer, probably my favorite, Joseph Habedank, Deeper Oceans, also signed by him. Yeah, he's a he's an amazing songwriter, really good guy too. Happy Goodman Family Hour. Uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, this is the Happy Goodman Family gospel singing group. Had a television program. Emmy Lou Harris, Blue Kentucky Girl. George Harrison, All Things Must Pass. George Harrison, Cloud Nine. George Harrison, uh, self-titled. Let me move this real quick. All right. Next up is Hendrix, uh, Electric Ladyland by the Jimi Hendrix Experience. Buddy Holly Lives, Buddy Holly and the Crickets, 20 Golden Greats. That's a really good one there. Buddy Holly Showcase. The Inspiration. The Inspirations, More to Go to Heaven For. It's another gospel quartet. I think my grandfather gave these to me. And here's another one, Songs of Love. Signed by a few people from the Inspirations. I don't know if you can see that it's like, they did it in like blue pen. Michael Jackson, Thriller. Billy Joel. 52nd Street, and here is my small Billy Joel collection. I'm actually almost complete on him, almost. Billy Joel, The Bridge. Billy Joel, Glass Houses. Billy Joel, An Innocent Man. Billy Joel, The Nylon Curtain. Billy Joel, Piano Man. Billy Joel, The Stranger. Billy Joel, Street Life Serenade. Yeah. Billy Joel, Turnstiles. This is a promotional copy, not for sale. But the back is pretty beat up. But it sounds great, really. And uh, I'm just missing from him his first album, Stormfront, and River of Dreams. And then I'll be complete on him. Next, uh, Elton John section, Blue Moves. Very underrated album. I really like that one. Captain Fantastic and the Brown Dirt Cowboy. Elton John, Don't Shoot Me, I'm Only the Piano Player. I got them all stacked up high right here. Elton John, Goodbye Elbrick Road. Elton John, Greatest Hits. Is this volume something? No, just Greatest Hits. Elton John, Madman Across the Water. Elton John, Tumbleweed Connection. Tumbleweed Connection. This is really underrated too. A nice little country inspired album from Elton. Uh, the Kinks are the Village Green Preservation Society. The Knack, get the Knack. This is John Lennon and Yoko Ono, Double Fantasy. This is like half John, half Yoko. 
John Lennon, imagine. Imagine. Plastigono band, John Lennon. John Lennon, walls and bridges. Uh, the Incredible Little Richard. Uh, sings his greatest hits. Um, don't buy this album. I actually, I didn't buy this, I found it, but I played it for the first time a couple days ago, and it sounds horrible. It, it is mixed so horribly. I love Little Richard, um, but it's just, this record sounds horrible. Don't buy it. Paul McCartney, Band on the Run. That's my Paul McCartney section. Paul McCartney, Egypt Station. This one is not in a protective sleeve because I can't find one big enough to fit this. Um, I don't know why. Because I found one that could fit Wings Over America, as you'll see, but not this. It's weird. Give my regards to Broad Street. The movie soundtrack. Uh, McCartney. His debut. McCartney 2 is very underrated. Pipes of Peace. There's Paul with the telescope. Ram, one of my favorite albums ever. Tug of War. Running out of room again. Don McLean, American Pie. Steve Miller Band, Fly Like an Eagle. Joni Mitchell, Court and Spark. Joni Mitchell, Ladies of the Canyon. Really like that one. The Moody Blues, In Search of the Lost Chord. This is a really good album cover there, too. Van Morrison, Astral Weeks. This is a reissue. It's one of my favorite albums ever. It's amazing. Van Morrison, uh, his band and the street choir. I'm so glad I found this um, without the wording on the top. I just love the album with no words, just his cover. It's amazing. It's also a pretty good album, too. Jim Neighbors by Request. Part singer, part actor. Jim Neighbors, Kiss Me Goodbye. This was the first record I ever got, and I played the heck out of it. Willie Nelson, Stardust. The Oak Ridge Boys. The best of the Oak Ridge Boys. The Alan Parsons Project, Eye in the Sky. Peter and Gordon, True Love Ways. Pink Floyd, Dark Side of the Moon. I th I'm pretty sure this is an original. This was given to me by somebody. I'm pretty sure it's an original. Pink Floyd, Metal. Pink Floyd, Wish You Were Here. This is one of the reissues that came with the, the bag. The Police, Synchronicity. This is the purple one. If you shine a light through it, it turns purple. Prince, Around the World in a Day. The Rack on Tours, Help Us Stranger. Yeah, Help Us Stranger. It's Jack White's band. Paul Revere and the Raiders, Revolution. That was also one of the first records I ever got. The Gambler, Kenny Rogers. Now to my small Stones section. The Stones, Black and Blue. The Rolling Stones, that is. If you haven't already guessed. Uh, Exile on Main Street. Goat's Head Soup. With all the hype stickers, but somebody drew on it. And uh, yeah, there's 
pictures of the band and he wrote the band members names for some reason whoever owned this let it bleed this is the clear clear vinyl i recently got that recently got this one too uh their satanic majesty's request this is the one where their heads move oh you can actually see it really good on on camera and film yep their heads move and then makes uh hands move and stuff and this is a really cool Stones album, really psychedelic. I like it a lot. Linda Ronstadt, Simple Dreams. Uh, Neil Sedaka, Neil Sedaka, Sedaka's back. I've never listened to this. I don't remember where I got this or why I have it, but I don't know any of his songs, so I need to listen to it. Bob Seger and the Silver Bullet Band, Night Moves. Good classic rock and roll. Bob Seger and the Silver Bullet Band. Uh, Stranger in Town, which is one of my favorite albums ever. It's so good. It's classic rock and roll. Uh, Paul Simon, still crazy after all these years. Underrated album there too. Simon and Garfunkel, Bookends. Simon and Garfunkel, Bridge Over Troubled Water. Simon and Garfunkel, The Graduate Soundtrack. This is amazing. And then they have, there's a other, other, it's not all Simon and Garfunkel on here. Some of the, uh, who is it? Joseph Levine has some instrumental stuff on here, which is, which is still good. The Sounds of Silence, Simon and Garfunkel. Frank Sinatra, Watertown. It's a really good one. Bruce Springsteen, Born in the USA. Bruce Springsteen, Born to Run. Bruce Springsteen, Nebraska. Cat Stevens, T for the Tiller Man. J.D. Sumner and the Stamps, the exciting Stamps Quartet. They sang back up with Elvis, but they were also a gospel group. J.D. Sumner and the Stamps sing gospel classics. Striper, To Hell with the Devil. I don't know why I have this or where I got it, but I have it. And I don't even really like music like this, but I just figured I'd keep it. Harry Styles, self-titled. Yeah. I am a fan of Harry. Russ Taff, Metals. Another gospel singer. Nope. The Greats of Gospel, Command Performance, a tribute to Leroy Abernathy, I think he was some sort of preacher, but that's really good, I like that. Michael W. Smith, 2, I've not even listened to that, I got it because my dad likes him. Jack White, Lazaretto, this is a really cool one where it plays backwards and depending on where you drop the needle, it plays a different song and all that. In the holograph. The Who, Quadrophenia. The Who, Tommy. Who's Next? By The Who. Three of the greatest albums ever. Uh, Wings at the Speed of Sound. Now going into my Paul McCartney and Wings section. Wings, Back to the Egg. Extremely underrated album. Wings, London Town. Wings Over America, the live album. This is very good. Wings, Red River Speedway, with the hype sticker. Venus and Mars, Wings. 
Wings Wildlife. Also underrated. I love this cover too. One of my favorites. Love the nature. Uh, fulfilling this is first finale, Stevie Wonder. I've only listened to this a few times, so I can't say much about it. But this one, Inner Visions, Stevie Wonder, is a masterpiece. Enough said. Yes, Tornado. I've never listened to this. Yes, the Yes album. I love this one. Good prog album. Neil Young, After the Gold Rush. Neil Young and Crazy Horse, Rust Never Sleeps. Good live album. And Led Zeppelin 2. So that is my entire record collection, guys. Thanks for sticking with me through it all. I do have uh, some singles uh, that I might show in a, another video later. But thanks for sticking with me. Um, I do, I am, I do have some on the way that I ordered that are taking forever to get here. I don't know why. I was trying to wait till they got here to do this, but I figured I'd just do an update, maybe every couple months or so, and just show you uh, recent picks, pickups I've got. Um, my local record store has not been open lately, so and they're not open, so I haven't been really picking up stuff. But I'm planning, I have pre-ordered like Bob Dylan's new album, uh, Paul McCartney has a new archive release of Flaming Pie that I'm going to be getting, the three, the three LP set I think, so I might do some unboxings, um, planning on maybe doing album reviews on here, just overall music discussions, so uh, stay tuned for that, and thank you all for watching, and I hope you guys have a great day.